Speaking of health, though, Eli Lilly has a drug to help type 2 diabetes, diabetes patient lose 50% of their body weight or 34 pounds on average. As a result, Eli Lilly hit all-time high of $407. What's the, what's the drug? Uh, like, no, no, I, nothing. You don't have, well, like, what's, what does it do? It's a type 2 diabetes drug to help you lose weight. Oh, okay. Rapidly. Oh, that's the thing that everybody's taking? Everybody's taking. Every, everybody. You know some people. Not everybody. Yeah. But that's on the black on the black market, everybody's taking this drug. What's the, can we can we find out the name of that drug? Because everybody's taking it right now. The and, people uh, that we know. Could you just shoot us a text of the name? Appreciate it's, it. It's, it. It's the weight. It's yeah. It's weight loss. Yeah. It, what are your thoughts on it? Uh you have a controversy. I feel like drugs them? always have some side effect. I agree. That's my only problem with drugs. Like it's always something that happens. Like you can't stop going to the bathroom. You you you. You're constipated, or you're you're throwing up in the morning, or you start to you know get nauseous. Mm -hmm. Um, so that's why I don't like to take drugs. I've never I've never been a proponent of taking drugs. Yeah, I'm not against taking drugs because I understand that sometimes you you know it is it's how it's needed, right? Like sometimes it's needed. I'm not I'm not an extremist. Yeah, but um, you know I come from like a very holistic family. Um, so that's kind of how I was raised. So I always try to go the natural route if possible before, before the drug route. Um, but th it is interesting that drug that you mentioned yep. because, um, it's been working. It, yeah. Yeah. Um, and, and it, it's, it's extremely popular on the black market right now. Um, and so, yeah, it'll be interesting to see. I mean, you, you have America where, I mean, I probably almost a majority of the people are overweight. Yeah. So, you know, it, they this, can't get it from the doctor. Like you said, black market. Cause I don't think you're supposed to get it. Like if you don't have diabetes, you're not supposed to get it. Oh, like, so you're saying people without diabetes. People are diabetes. using it just to lose, lose weight. weight. Lose I, weight. Got yeah. I got you. I got you. So I don't think that it's like, um, you know, I, I don't, I'm not hundred percent sure on this, but I don't think a doctor is supposed to be giving that to you hmm. unless you medically need it. Uh, some of the people who, who we know have texted us. Uh, Ozapak and it's, there's one. Hold on a sec. We'll leave oh, their we'll leave their names anonymous. Yeah. Um, What's the name of the drug? Manjara. Am I saying that right? Manjaro. Ozapak. Yeah. Yeah. Ozapak is one. It's better. Ozapak. Um. That Ozapak. We on the Ozapak tonight. They, they, <laughs> Ozapak. They lower your uh A1C, but it helps with weight loss. Yeah, the weight loss, man. Shut one year up. return for Eli Lilly, 40%, 40.15%, and one year. Five year return, 417%. Lifetime return, 9,725%. Shout out to Indianapolis, Indiana, one of the greatest companies of all time. That's a solid. Eli Lilly. If you've been holding since I've told you, well played. Well played. Well played. So the last the last five years for that has been 400 yeah. percent yeah, 400%. Yeah, 400 417%. For a big well, and let's go re go research, put in chat. I know y'all hate to open the questions. What where does Eli Lilly rank in the healthcare space? Is it number one, two, three, or four? Let me know. This is why I keep saying folks on top two. Wait, who's two? Who you got it to? Uh, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not messing with nobody outside Lilly. They they are so dominant. Is striker in your top five? Definitely. Okay. Shark, Shark is in top five. Okay. Yeah. So Eli Lilly is your number one healthcare Absolutely. company. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lilly's Brian. Shout out to Brian. Shout out to, Shout to Brian. Well, that's, I mean, because, yeah, I mean, you know, it's the biggest business in America. Yep. And there's always going to be a need for something, whether it's a need for Viagra, whether it's a need for weight loss, whether it's a need for whatever. Like, you know, people want the short term solution. Absolutely. People Absolutely. want the short term solution. And that is why the pharmaceutical and the drug industry Absolutely. has made so much money mm -hmm. um, because it's like, yeah, I'd rather still eat cheesecake and take a, and take a blood pressure pill. How about you stop eating cheesecake? That's an option. Not so if you shop to everyone that had to go walk for cheesecake on making the band too. Also, hold on, um, hold on. They said I'm botching the name crazy. Ozem pick. Ozem pick. Okay. And it's prescribed. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, research team. Well, <laughs> and here's how you should know if you should invest in pharma. Do you think that the population of American citizens will get healthier over the next 20 years? No. Or sicker? If you think that they're going to get sicker, you need to invest in pharma for long-term gains. 
probably in 10, 15 years, if they don't split, Eli Lilly should be like at 1500 bucks. Amazing. Yeah, that is that is pretty amazing. Yeah. The money's right. in the treatment. Well, we will monitor the situation. My graduates from my school being Forbes. Backdrop. Backdrop. <laughs> a mic drop. Backdrop. Backdrop. <laughs>